Hello everybody and welcome to the video preview for Thursday, July 21st. I'm going to run through and give you a quick video preview of all the goodies we're going to have out for bid today. Got a lot of HO trains. Uh, Greg did number these trays, or letter these trays. Tray K will be sold all as one tray full. Miscellaneous parts. Tray J, same deal. If you have any questions, folks, don't hesitate to let us know. I'm more than happy to send you additional photos or just answer your questions. Uh, tray H and G will be choice off the uh, engines. The rest of the trays here will be sold by the tray full. There's even a Conrail. Tray B and C are both full of track. Tray A. Twenty piece pottery. Nice money clip there. I believe it to be gold. It is not marked. You're running choice of the uh, jewelry, or choice of the rings here. Uh, there is three pieces there that are gold filled, or gold plated. A lot better details and pictures when it comes time for auction. This will be sold as a tray full. Beautiful pieces on here. Complete set of Rogers in near mint condition. We have the uh, horns back here. Tray of watches here will be run choice. Through the uh, silver coin on there also. That's a uh, .999 silver, uh, one ounce. All the wheat pennies in the case for one price, not the case. And we will also run choice here of the gemstones tonight. Uh, some of these are marked $40, $50, $70 a piece. We're we'll running choice of those. Longenberger. Another choice item. Sorry about all the choices. Choice of the three bags. Or purses. Wallets. You know what I mean. <laughs> On a tray, we'll be getting sold by the tray full unless otherwise noted. Look at that set there in the original box. All poinsettia. Poinsettia, however you want to pronounce it. These are Irish linens. Great for a nursery. Do have some tools for today. Choice of the two jacks. We have a nice Porter cable, 135 PSI uh, compressor, pancake style. Whole stack of really nice uh, shelving brackets. And the uh, winch. It's an ATV utility winch. So you would hook that up to your uh, four wheeler or your. You know what I mean. Stack of games today. Nice old Monopoly down in there. Kids' toys. That is John Deere, both of them. She said she looked these this stack up online, and this brings $100 for that stack. The whole Time Life series there.
gun case, electric wine bottle opener, Ooh, they're pretty, oh they're QVC, the luminary, yeah QVC. Good choice of the two today. They're the big ones. Nice throw. Two old uh, quilts. This blue one here is Land's End. That one's homemade. Bed wedges. A pair of those, brand new. Some car parts today. Let's go to the back here. Tupperware stuff. It's all full of those flags. A golf tray. I know some of these golf balls are really expensive. My stepfather's a big golfer, and I've heard prices on how much those boxes of balls are. In the case, we'll be getting sold by the case full. A lot of these are local. There's Wilkesbury in there. Uh, let's see here. There's Milton. A couple other ones I saw earlier. Whole tray of patriotic flag uh, pins. Another nice tray of Christmas. Kitchen type collector tray. Some old toys. It's a nice tray full. What else am I missing here? 51 by 75, 20 pound weighted blanket in like new condition. I don't know if it was ever used. A nice set of Carhartt bibs. The tag is uh, worn off there. I want to say they're about a 34 or 36 waist. Full-size reversible comforter. Nice collectibles on this tray. This is marked Mexico on the bottom. It's a bank. That's really nice tile. Sunglass lot today. And more. Some Lennox exerciser. Really nice bow today. And a safety helmet. All right, as I turn around here, we see the uh, Millville, Pennsylvania throw. A nice creeper here, like new condition. Work table. We have these shanks, I mean these uh, skewers, for your barbecue. Whole tray full of those, all in great shape. Choice of the coolers. This will get sold as a lot. I have two of the Sam's Club coolers, the large ones. They'll get sold for one price. Sprayer. And these are more coolers. We'll be selling both of those for one price. It's a pair of uh, kids' wetsuits. These are size 10, it says. All right, let's come on over here. Next up we have here is a mongoose uh, off-road bicycle. Very expensive, and then he went and put all the bells and whistles on it that you can possibly think of. We've got a nice uh, pump there. We've got brand new. She said he just bought this and never got a chance to even put, use the lock. Uh, we've got the water bottle holder on there, and also the helmet. Uh, she said is a brand new helmet too. He's got the tail light on it. Very nice extra seat or new seat. I have a backyard grill. 
uh, charcoal style grill and gas. Charcoal one side, gas on the other. Very clean there, folks. Wouldn't take much at all to uh, brush those grates off and start using it. We just didn't get a chance to do that ourselves. Uh, I've got some golfing stuff here. Golf clubs, bag, and more golf clubs to go along with that one. Nice mirror. I like the frame this is on. The stuff behind this is not for sale. Really nice uh, brass picture frame holder. Art holder. All about office chair. Lots of stuff over here. Really nice travel bag on wheels. Rubbermaid garbage can. Very clean with lid. I've got a nice utility cart. It has lots of little spots here to do all kinds of stuff. Perfect for hobbies or anything like that. And there's even some extra shelving pieces in there that you can use. Very heavy duty rollabout. Now, first up here on the plain stuff. Uh, this is all balsa wood. Never assembled, never taken out of the box. Balsa USA model aircraft. I did slide the box open here. So you can see what this was. This is a Piper Club or Cub uh, J3. It's a one in three scale, so it's a very, very large airplane once you have it all assembled. You can uh, check that one out online. The pictures are online of that one. This here is a flight navigational knee board. It's called a Navidata knee board. The gentleman used to be a pilot. Uh, the straps to your knee when you're flying an airplane. And you can uh, record your flight plans uh, and all the other kind of type of stuff here. This here is a GPS for an airplane, a portable GPS. It's called a GPS map by Garmin 195. Look that one up online. You uh, just basically turn it on and punch in where you want to go and it gives you the flight path. Next up, RC airplane. Uh, we have this gas-powered RC airplane. It is going to come with all the accessories here on the table. You get this beautiful airplane ready to fly. I don't have the wings uh, screwed down. There's the bottle of fuel, jet fuel he called it. And there's all your electronics and stuff in there. We have the battery for the starter. That's an expensive piece right there. There's the remote control. That's this. All this is usually separate. We've got the power panel for your starters and stuff and your top fueler, electric fuel pump. Fill that thing right on up. Guys, very, very nice. That'll get sold all as one lot on this airplane. Next up I have here is a nice stack of uh, fishing rods. Sorry, I'm a little out of space and a lot of out of light to show you those very good. A lot better pictures when it comes time for auction. Let's come on over here. I've got a really nice uh, tile saw. Heavy, heavy tile saw on the nice stand. Pump and everything is here. And brackets. Very heavy duty. Next up, Boy Scout lot, guys. Check this one out. This is a little fortune right here. Uh, let's see here. This was awarded here a 1967 fourth place scouting uh, display award. Very nice. Congratulations to them. Look at all the Boy Scout posters. What a display. And we're going to include this uh, picture along with it. It's got a lot of four-leaf clovers in it. Uh, Walter Becker, if you know Walter Becker, his photo's in there. All right, guys. I think I've shown you pretty much everything we have out available for uh, Thursday's sale. Another auction again on Friday. You don't want to miss that one. Lots of goodies going to be coming up for that too. All right, let's do it one more time. If you need a better number for today's auction, please private message on into the auction gallery on Facebook, and we will get you registered to bid. If you don't have Facebook, you can always email your information into us at the auction gallery co, co at gmail.com. If you cannot attend the sale and would like to leave a left bid, please leave your left bid before auction time. We just need to know the items you're interested in, your maximum bid amount, 
and your bidder number. We will take care of the bidding for you, make it nice and easy. All right, folks, we'll see you Thursday at 3 o'clock. Have a wonderful day.